Okay, guys, today I'm going to teach you how to make the laser pointer sight for the uh, Glock 18, my Glock 18 model. Uh, you need a slanted 2x2, two two, sorry, a two, another 2x2, two two, but it's not slanted or anything. You need a vent or a flat piece, whichever you prefer, for the vent. You need one of these pieces you get off like a Lego racer set. You need whatever color you want your laser to be. Oh, just a little light. You need this R2-D2 piece, whatever it is. You need one of these. It has to have the cross on the end. Uh, you need this round circular tube. You need this circular plate thing. And then you need four two by ones, and then you need two by one with a cross in it. Okay, well, this is how you make it. You take the little R two D two body, and you put the dot on the front of it, just like this, and it has to go on the pointed part like that. Then. You take your circular plate and your circular tube and hook them both together. Then you hook the little cross piece on like that. Then you take another one of your 2 by ones and hook it on the back so it should look like that so far. And you take another one or two. Then you take that two by two you got and put stick it straight on the top of it so it stays down good. And then this is where that little piece comes. And you hook that cross into the cross, and you should have this tube sticking up the top. Then you take your little slanted piece and hook it on like that. And remember, it has to have the studs on the back exactly like that. And then you take another one of your 2x1s and put it on like that. Then you take that circular plate and that circular tube you hooked together and put it right straight on the back. Then you take both your two, the rest of your 2x1s, hook them together, hook them on there. You take the little racers thing, put it on the back like that. You put your vent on. And it should look like this as your finished product and then on your pistol or whatever you're using it on make sure you put a small square piece on so you can hook the tube into it and it fits perfect just like that